Hey guys, I am Gautam and welcome to GKMix. In this video, I am going to talk about IIT Jump 2020 that you know that uh, from tomorrow, the form fill up uh, process will be started and for Jam 2020. So who want to keep the Jam examination and want to pursue masters, uh, PhD or MSc PhD dual degree like that programs from IITs, uh, IISRs, then NITs or uh, other primary institutes like JNCSR or ISCS like that. So over there also Jam ranks matters. Okay, so if you want to pursue masters, then you have to uh, appear in JAM examination. Okay, for uh, for these subjects, for these uh, courses that um, MSc, Joint MSc, PhD, and MSc, PhD, or some things like MSc, MTech programs are also there. Okay, so uh, I think for physics subjects. Okay, so that is about the subject. And now, what you need to do, you have to. In, uh, know a lot of information regarding that that the form fill up process will be started on September 5 then the for last date will be October 8 and the mock test link that will yeah you will find one mock test on that on this website that uh, the mock test will be based on the question patterns uh, what will be the same uh, uh, as the uh, IIT jam 2020 examination okay that just the question pattern will be same and last year what they did they just uh, uploaded the previous year question papers and uh, Took the mock test but that doesn't help a lot because you have already solved the previous year question papers okay but if you uh, if they provide a new question papers that will be far more better for you so whatever i don't know what what they will do okay so now you will find admit card from january 7 to till the examination date and the final information you need to know that the examination will uh, be on february 9 okay February 9 the examination will be and the result will be published on March 20 but generally they uh, publish the results uh, nearly March 20 or sometimes they uh, publish the results as 15 to 16 March okay so that that depends upon them so whatever other information you need to know right now so the I can I want to tell you two two uh, two things regarding this that you uh, have two papers paper one and paper two from paper one uh, the paper on uh, paper one will be from 9 30 a.m. to 12 30 p.m. and the second one that is that will paper two will held on from uh, 2 30 p.m. to 5 30 p.m. so in case of paper one there are three subjects biotechnology mathematical statistics and physics in case of paper two three subject, subjects chemistry geology and mathematics so you can choose maximum two papers from uh, paper one you, you have to choose one from paper two, you have to choose one. So if you want to uh, give the jam examination in two papers, then you can choose one subject from paper one and one subject from paper two. You can't choose two subjects once two subjects from the same paper. That is, uh, for example, chemistry and geology. You can choose these two uh, papers for the jam examination. Okay. So this information you need to know regarding that. Okay. Now let's talk about other things like like the corresponding uh, institutes. Okay, so the list of institutes are like that IIC Bangalore, IIT Vilai, IIT Bhubaneswar, IIT Bombay, IIT Delhi, Dhanbad, Gandhinagar, Gowati, like that. Okay, you, and you know a lot of IITs have been, has been added this year. So there are total 21 IITs, okay, and the C number of seats nearly more than 600. I am talking about chemistry, I don't uh, have idea about uh, in mathematics also. Uh, so far, I know that. The, subject, uh, the number of seats nearly 600 or more than 600 for physics also more or less same okay so for biotechnology it's a lot of um, less than 100 or 100 like seats i whatever i know okay so this is the number of seats regarding that okay so now let's talk about some information regarding this that the examination cities you know uh, the nearest cities you will uh, you can easily uh, find whenever you want to fill up the form okay so another information i want to give you that uh, i will definitely make it form fill up process okay the, the video you will get within one two days okay so whoever uh, uh, can't fill up their forms okay you can follow me uh, whenever uh, within one or two days i will fill up the form okay another uh, thing is that the last date of form fill up is 8 october so you have a lot of time okay so i have told you the uh, examination schedule that is that will be held on uh, 9th february okay 9th february from 9 am to 12 30 pm and 12 30 pm to 5 30 pm and the examination schedule you know the examination fee will be quite different that for female every categories general obviously whatever for female sc st and pwd 
for one test paper you have to pay 750 rupees and for two test papers you have to pay 1050 rupees okay and for all others that is general uh, all male general and obc candidates for one test papers you have to pay 1500 rupees and for other test two test paper you have to pay 2100 rupees okay this is the examination fees okay and the pattern what will be the pattern of question papers the the there will be section a okay that will be same uh, 10 question papers that will carry uh, 10 question papers that will carry one mark and another 20 question papers that will carry two marks so section a will contain 30 mcq multiple choice question and section b uh, multiple choice choice questions in in which 10 questions will carry one mark and 30, 20 questions will carry two marks each so there will be total 50 marks from section a now coming to section b in section b there will be total 10 multiple select questions okay that is that will that, will, that is uh, more than one answers will be correct okay this uh, that is the question pattern so from section b you will find 10 questions that will carry one two marks each that is total 20 marks from section b and from section c there will be total 20 numerical answer type that is uh, the mathematical type questions or you have to fill in the blanks uh, by putting some numbers by putting some values by putting some values after calculate after doing a lot of calculations like that okay so you have to just put the values numbers or uh, after calculating a lot of um, problems from physical chemistry you have to put the answers okay that will be in uh, numericals so in which 10 question will carry one marks each and another 10 question will carry two marks each so there will be total 30 marks from uh, section c so from section a 50 marks from section b 50, uh, 20 marks and from section c 30 marks there will be total 100 marks okay for uh, you know the for one uh, and each in case of section a that is for mcq questions uh one third and two thirds that means uh suppose you have uh for one marks questions one third marks will be deducted if you give any wrong answer and for two marks questions two third marks will be deducted if you uh, give any wrong answer okay so and another thing is online virtual calculator will be there okay and for part b section b and section c there will be no negative marking remember this one from for section b and section c no negative marking negative marking will be applicable for only section a okay it's done so virtual calculator will be provided and other electronic devices will not be provided that you know of course you will find in your uh, admit card okay so it's done so now the eligibility criteria uh, coming to the eligibility criteria so for jam candidates you have to qualify the graduation okay or you if you are in final year you can also apply, apply you are you can also apply for that for obc and general candidates okay so uh, this this is the important thing for general and obc candidate okay you have to get 55 percent marks okay or 5.5 cgpa out of 10 okay for general and obc candidates uh taking all subjects that is taking into account all subjects remember this not the honors or major subject okay or science subjects all subjects including languages and subsidiaries that means languages uh, so english like that and your corresponding if you have uh, your state language okay or environmental science you have to consider also and for other candidates that is scst or pwd there will be 50 percent marks or cgpa 5 out of 10 okay that is necessary taking all subjects or including language or other things okay remember this one so uh, now it's done that is important okay so you have to qualify with this number very low uh, number less number you have to get to appear for this examination okay and other thing is that uh, minimum educational and educational qualification is totally important that let me zoom out this space okay so for by remember this one uh, just uh, take a uh, pause this video and read all this information okay let's i am talking only chemistry students okay so for chemistry these iits will take uh, the admission okay and joint for joint msc phd in chemistry iit bhubaneswar and iit kharagpur will uh, uh, will allow it to get into it okay and another program is if you appear for iit jam chemistry joint msc phd program in nuclear medicine you can also apply for this course okay nuclear medicine this year this course has been added okay sorry last year this course has been added okay and for others like iit bombay and msc phd dual degree in environmental science and engineering if you don't know what is dual degree what is joint msc phd you can check my previous videos okay so over there i have discussed these things and also joint msc phd program in atmospheric and ocean sciences 
uh, that will be in IIT Bhubaneswar that you can also apply over there okay so this is chemistry and you can check other things okay going in in this website and other important criteria for chemistry okay is that you have to have these essential quality subjects at, at 10 plus 2 level okay uh, for MSc chemistry if you want to apply for MSc chemistry uh, except IIT Indore okay except IIT Indore that is IIT I okay you have to have mathematics okay in your graduate in your 10 plus 2 if you don't have mathematics uh, if you don't if you are not from PCM uh, section then you can't apply for these uh, IITs you have to, only you are applicable in IIT Indore like that okay so these things uh, is to be imp is very important and other for other subjects like nuclear medicine you don't need any kind of mathematics but for environmental science you have you need mathematics for oceanographic sciences and atmospheric sciences you don't need mathematics okay so for other subjects also you can uh, see the el minimum eligibility criteria that is very very important okay so you can you will get the link in the description below and you can get, go to the link and then you can see this el uh, special eligibility criteria okay so now the i have told you everything about this examination okay admit card minimum educational qualification and other things will be uh, after the examination okay uh, other information i will provide you after the uh, examination how you can fill up the form how we can uh, apply for iits to get into it okay how you uh, after getting the rank how can you what iits you can expect like that every information i will provide you after the iitism examination but uh, within one or two days uh, you will get another videos on uh, how to fill up the IITM, how to fill up the application form okay for IITM examination okay so for that you will get another videos and if you want to download other things like previous question papers like that you can go to this website and you can get everything okay so just i don't need to tell uh, you can get also syllabus other different syllabus for different exams okay and how to apply for the examination you will get everything what will be the required documents for that okay you will get everything in this website so you will get the link in the uh, description below and one more important thing is that uh, if you are uh, if you are preparing iit gem chemistry examination okay so if you want to get high quality study material that i provide you that uh, what i read during my preparation that material i provide you generally so then you can get that material from me you just need to uh, check the description you will get whatsapp number or mobile number whatever you can call me you can whatsapp me for that material okay and also you will get free practice sets free numericals okay chapter wise okay for very very at very very low cost at very 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 low cost okay and you can also get the demo in the description below okay so just check there and whatever enjoy and start your preparation and do it uh, with a regular study you can easily crack this examination just believe me the examination is not very very tough okay so good luck a very very good luck from me okay just thank you thank for thanks for watching